Nigel Farage warned Leo Varadkar about tax rates in the EU, claiming Ireland has no advantages from its membership of the bloc. Ireland has committed to a global accord which it hopes will boost multinationals' tax bills. The new agreement sees the country charging multinationals 15% on profits, however, around 160,000 firms will continue to remain on the lower rate if 12.5%. Ireland has, for decades, been defending its 12.5% rates in the country, saying it is an immovable cornerstone for the country. Despite these claims, Ireland agreed on Thursday night to join more than 130 nations in the Organisation for Economic Cooperation and Development Broker Deal. Along with Ireland, Estonia has joined the accord, seeing their rates rising also. Finance Minister for Ireland, Pascal Donohoe, said, We have secured the removal of, at least, in the text as we sort. Some countries wanted higher minimum tax rates, and our position moderated those ambitions and views. This provides certainty in the agreement. The main issue with joining this accord was the use of the word, at least, in the agreement. According to Mark Redmond, Chief Executive of American Chamber of Commerce Ireland, Mr. Redmond said, removing, at least, is really important. Would you sign a contract to buy my house for, at least, €400,000, without any safeguards? I don't think so, so what's been achieved here is not just good for Ireland, but good for certainty in global tax. However, former UKIP and Brexit party leader Nigel Farage took to Twitter to hound Ireland for joining this accord. 